Hi, everybody. Mary Jane Burke here. We're so excited to have you all here on day one of Wellness Week. So this is our third session of today. I just want you to know this is being recorded and it's being simultaneously translated into Spanish. We want to make absolutely sure that you are keeping track of your activities and that you sign on to the Google form for the prizes for Friday afternoon. Michelle Drake, take it away and translate for me, please. You got it. Hola y bienvenido a Semana del Bienestar Ad Marin. Este webinar se está grabando y presentando en inglés y si se traduce simultáneamente al español. Muchas gracias a Marta Bichon, que es nuestra interpretación. Thank you. Thanks, Michelle. So just as a reminder, this is definitely our opportunity to get tools into our tool belts, to be able to take good care of ourselves. And for this afternoon, just imagine the amazing youth and arts, the amazing youth and arts director, Kristen Jacobson. And now I'm going to let Austin, introduce you to the amazing, incredible, passionate, wonderful students from, what shall we call them? Till Dawn, here you go. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. Um, today's Wellness Week we're in is focusing on the physical and social dimensions of wellness. Um, and that really directly connects to Till Dawn in so many ways. First of all, um, music helps our brains process language. Um, and so if you think about the nuanced way, uh, the nuanced levels of listening that are required to make a cappella music and to sing, um, these young people uh, and anybody who's engaged in music um, has a deeper understanding of how to listen and how to communicate more effectively. Um, also, research has shown that just listening to music can reduce anxiety, blood pressure and pain, as well as including, uh, improving sleep quality, mood, mental alertness and memory. Um, so one of the things that the pandemic has definitely revealed to us is that students need extra space to focus on wellness to, to process the stress, anxiety, and trauma caused by this pandemic. And making sure that students and families have time to create in their school day or at home is exactly why an organization like Youth and Arts exists. Um, Till Dawn is a program of Youth and Arts. This year, we are partnering with more schools than ever to make sure students have access to the arts to support their mental and physical wellness. And now, without any further ado, <laughs> please give a warm welcome. Um, you can even unmute for a moment if you can. To Youth and Arts' Till Dawn! <laughs> All right, the first song we'll be doing is Morse Code of Love, done by the Capris. Thank you 
and now we'd like to take a moment to introduce ourselves. Um, my name is Paul McCoo, and I go to Archie Williams High School. Uh, my name is Inara, and I go to San Marin High School. I'm Laura, and I go to Ten High. I'm Nathan Bodette, and I go to San Marin. I'm Jocelyn, I go to Archie Williams High School. I'm Bella, and I go to Archie Williams High School. My name is Eliana Rivera, and I go to Archie Williams as well. I'm Emma, I go to Redmond High School. I'm Megan, I go to Santa Rosa Junior College. I'm Elisa, I go to San Marin. I'm Aiden Donaldson, I go to Marin School of the Arts. And our next song will be Loves in the Year of Love Today, originally done by Stevie Wonder, brought to you by Emma. <laughs>
Lindsay's Sweet Dreams, originally by the Arithmetics, brought to you by Elisa. <laughs> <laughs> sharing your amazing voices and energy and positivity with everyone here. To Youth and Arts, Kristen Austin, thank you so much. Um, don't forget, everybody, uh, get online, track what you've been doing for um, to make sure that you are um, involved and taking good opportunity to put tools in your tool belt so that um, you are able to feel full um, and well 
um, as we continue to do the good work in our schools, in our county, in our hospitals, everyone in our community. So a reminder, sign that Google form because prizes for Friday, we're very excited about those. Um, there was a question in the chat um, about is youth and art, I mean, oh no, is um, Till Dawn going to be performing any time this holiday season? Do we have anything scheduled that people could come? December 9th. Yep, oh, December 9th. What Marin time? Country Mark. Oh my gosh, you guys, did you hear that? 6 p.m. Oh, five, okay. 5 p.m. Okay, 5 p.m. Did you hear that? So get ready. December 9th is a big day. Four o'clock. There's a meeting with Matt Willis and Lisa Santora, just totally updating us on COVID protocols. Then we need to get right over to the country mark, <laughs> right? Very good to have a chance to hear till dawn. So to all of you, thank you so very much. Don't forget, tomorrow morning, 745 is going to start with a mindful moment. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Thank you.